here are the things I'd like to say we're afraid of talking about. But I don't think we're afraid to talk about it because we're too far off of it to recognize that there's a connection. So there's no fear. We just don't talk about it. But here are the things we're afraid to talk about. Seeing some guy on there talking about how, uh, you know, these businesses during the quarantine were saying we've never been doing any better. All the while, the government was giving everything to the people that weren't at work. I was, I was work because I am what you call an essential worker, the quintessential worker. They got rid of everybody around me and kept me in place because things needed to be done and I was cheap. So to begin with, I was there through the whole thing. Now you've got people saying, uh, Business has never been better. The stocks were up for them, for the people that were making the money. And yet we had to suffer the idea of supply and demand, supply chain issues. And I brought it up to the new president somewhere in the last week or so ago, the GIC, the guy in charge, walking through with him. And I said, it's bullshit. They said the supply chain issues. And he's like, Oh yeah, it was hard to get things. And I said, no, it goes right back to the fucking toilet paper. This toilet paper thing was a test to see how much you could freak people out and turn them against you and create a higher supply. Even though six months down the road, there won't be that demand anymore because people have it all gobbed up. The only way they're going to keep coming and buying it is if they believed it all and they're afraid that it's still going on. Ah, you know, if it's so bad when you can't get toilet paper because the neighbors are buying it up, that's what they pushed us on. They made us all buy it. Just go wipe your ass on the neighbor's drape. She can wash it, it'll be okay. And if she's not allowing herself to be a good, decent person and share a roll of toilet paper with a neighbor, then she's not a neighbor to begin with. She's just a person that's squatting next door. A neighbor has, has a definition. A neighbor takes care of a neighbor but we don't see that so much anymore. So these are the things we're afraid to talk about. And I told him, I said, you see this? I said, these people made us believe that there wasn't gonna be enough toilet paper. They knew better, but they made us believe it out of an experiment. How much can we get people to buy shit up, just hoard it? You know, it's, it's instant gratification, the money that comes in from that. It's hard to keep it going. That's the future collapse of a nation is when they've sold everything they need to sell. Nobody needs anything more. Now they can't sell anything anymore. They're locked down. And this guy's 
Yes, you know, it was a test on us just to see if we would fall into it. And he said, well, your supply chain issues. I said, no, 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 no. I said, look at all this shit you got all over. Look at all this shit. You don't need this much. You've got enough for two to three years and it's ruining your efficiency because to get to what you need today, you have to go through two to three years worth of shit that's in the way. And so it's destroying it. And he said, well, um, it, we had to get it because might not get to be able to get it in the future. And I said, you know, if, <laughs> we are able to get it. It keeps rolling in. And I said, and he says, yes, but there are supply chain issues still. And I said, yes, it's because we've turned each other against each other. It's because we took all the resources available and hoarded them. Now your neighbor can't get them. It's because we have all the shit over here. And they're like, well, there's a supply chain issue. No, you put this on us. And it continues. We're afraid to say it, it's boring but it's reality, they keep fucking lying to us as an experiment. Who? Well, uh, I'm so sick of saying who they are. They are the people that don't want you to know their name. So they just send this thing out in there, this leak of information and allow themselves to be called they. Nobody's answering for this. It's a good thing we got Trump around as a distraction. Otherwise, we would be focusing on the real problem.